All right, let's get this show on the road. How are you all doing? Uh, that might be a little loud. We'll see. We'll see. So I think I fixed the mouse issues I was having last time I played. Yeah, it's a little loud. It's a little loud. All right. So, um, I got through this part that I was getting stuck at continuously. Um, but I think I fixed the mouse issues I was having, so of course we'll have to see if that is actually the case. Got him. Oh no. Why am I overheated still? Okay. Get him. Oh, I missed him. Oh. Big boy. Got him. This rocket drone is like spazzing out. What's going on with that? Is it dead? No, it is just running around in circles. What the heck is it doing? It's like it's stuck in like this loop. Is it dead now? Goodness gracious. Right, it's up here. Ta oh, I knew that was going to happen. God. Gosh darn it. Not my own fault. This uh, this is not the shirt to wear when you're streaming video. That's what we're gonna learn from this. Oh my goodness, those textures did not load. That was just gross. Alright, he's dead. He's incapacitated. Goodness gracious, this is kind of annoying. Uff. Where is it? Got that one.
Where is this other one? Hey, Sawyer! Alright, is that everybody? No, there's, there's this one that's like doing laps up here. I don't know what it's doing. We'll take a break. Do some hacking. Why not? So this guy... There's, there's one... No worries, man. That one that was causing so much trouble has been handled. There's one more up here. Where is it? Oh, yikes! 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 Oh. Okay, these uh, rocket drones are real scary. That's everybody. Cool. Handled. Let's go open the med kit. I can't. Goodness, why can't I decrypt that? Let's go into my squad. We'll go to tally. Undo. Why isn't she upgrading her decryption stuff? We're going to go into settings and. I was trying to make my life easy. I'm going to turn off auto level up. Because I'm kind of getting annoyed by having to deal with that. But let's go ahead and level me up. Um, let's... Uh, We'll do that one. Sounds like a good plan. Tally is still low on health. But I'm not gonna waste a med kit on her. I know that sounds real bad, but... Oh. Who's shutting down the torches? That was weird. Why did that why did that uh subtitle come up so quickly? Oh no. Oh <sighs> Obviously not what we wanted to happen. Let's go. I love how lackadaisically Shepard is just walking right now. Like, not a care in the world. No stress. He just heard this woman's brother get shot on the phone, and you're not even stressed about it. Like, what's going on? Right, so I think... I must have already turned off the mines. I think... I can't remember. I think my, um... Yeah, there's my, my, my car. There you are, Ma the Mako. Alright, so we're gonna... So we've done these three sites, we've done this site. So this is the last fusion torch. 
But we're gonna go hit this survey station too. Um, just to finish this little side quest that we got. I kind of wish these sections had more um, stuff going on. You know, like, I like the atmospheric music. It's cool. But, at the same time. I definitely wouldn't say no to some rockin' background music. Okay, I got an army tool. I'll take it. Drop ships landing near the main facility. There are flashes of light over the horizon. I can't be certain, but I'd guess it's heavy arms fire. Where are they? Yikes. That was kind of a shit show. But hey, whatever. We're alive. Barely. Alright. Um, I'm real low on health. I'm waiting for the... I so I have to wait for the my uh you know thing to respawn. Main facility, there's another fusion torch. Let's go we gotta put out this fusion torch first. So let's go do that. Fight these stupid turrets. All right. There's a couple more, I think. Yeah. Oh. Hmm. There's not nearly as much elevation as there should be on this cannon.
that all of them? Yep, cool. Let's heal. And we're gonna head in here. So it's crazy. I think the last time I played this game, I played it on... Um, I played it on PS3. And man, are the load times abysmal. much point blank shotgun uh, blast you have to take before you die huh huh is my shotgun just that bad like I just I don't understand I mean it's not this one does considerably more damage I guess um I guess we can do that one. I'm not sure what exactly is going on. Okay. Got him. Good job. Took you long enough. Um. Let's go check out in here. Got some grenades. I went with Vanguard. And 
and welcome to the stream, Rox. like there were bad guys but I don't see any bad guys hold it right there this doesn't have to end in bloodshed okay don't come any closer we can do this the hard way and we can end this peacefully I didn't think you Batarians knew the meaning of the word. Look, I'm just doing my job here. Hijacking yeah. It's, it's one of those things where I'm kind of spoiled by the other two mass by the by the next two Mass Effect games. Um and so whenever I come back and play Mass Effect 1, I I have a lot of time. Um I have a lot of hard difficulty adjusting to the different type of gameplay. Don't you think I know that? We're just following orders here. If it were up to me, we'd have already left. Well, it's not too late. You can still leave. I don't think so. Bollock would skin me alive and sell my hide out of spite. Crazy bastard. This whole mission's gone to hell and I'm gonna pay for it. So why do you listen to him? like a true lackey. You get me out of here and I'll take care of Balak. Or you can take your chances with me. Huh. An interesting proposal. It certainly has benefits over the current situation. Shut it down. This is Balak's problem now. I hope you're as quick with a gun as you are with your promises. For both our sakes. Balak will get what's coming to him. And so will you if I ever catch you in enemy territory. Got him. Cool, that's done. Yeah, right, but I didn't do the, um, with that one, one of the, the option, the really, the pair, the real bad renegade option is they're trying to get you to, to shoot him and have that be the end of it, and so I think that that's kind of where they're trying to lead you, um, which I, of course, didn't do that, so it's, it's, that option is technically more paragon than just killing him outright. I hate these stupid turrets. Come on, activate.
Oh, missed it. Bam. Woo! Look at that. Just dodging like a pro. Now I'm stuck on a beam. But that's fine. Alright. Let's actually go in here. And we're gonna put... Two more in the throw. And we'll go to Liara. I definitely turned off auto level. Um, but cool. Did I not turn off auto level? Off. Apply. Apply. Okay, it's definitely off now. I thought I had turned it off before. Let's just quick save to make sure. Okay. We're gonna go this way. Hmm. Where is he? Where is he? Gah! This could not have gone worse! Okay. This is going really bad. Um, okay. Oh, yikes. Oh my goodness, where am I getting shot from? What the heck? This is not that difficult. What the heck? How did that- why is this going so badly? 
That's that's the question to ask, right? No, we're gonna rock this shotgun because clearly I can't do anything right with the pistol. Okay, that went better, but but better, of course, is a relative term. Yikes. Why am I crouched? What the heck is the button to uncrouch? Oh man, fight! Uh, some firefights in this game are such a pain sometimes. I don't know why I couldn't uncrouch. What was up with that? Why was I glitching and not uncrouching when I walked away from the walls and stuff? What was going on? This really isn't that hard of a mission. Already! What the heck? What the heck? What even hit me? Alright, this is getting kind of ridiculous. I'm getting kind of annoyed. I'm getting a little uh, pissed off. Some parts of this game are honestly a little broken. But it's like use cover. Cool. I have used cover. It has now gotten me led to me dying a bunch of times.
All right, we're gonna we're gonna start from the top and move down just to keep them from freaking flanking us like that. How do I get them just to come with me? Is it this one? Handled. I got some more first aid. All right. All right. This isn't going absolutely terribly. It's not going well. Okay. Now it gets fun. Where is this idiot? that everybody there's one last guy chilling somewhere Where the heck is he? Wow. Good job, buddy. You just hid in this little storage crate. You humans. You're almost 
cause more trouble than you're worth. Let the hostages go. Maybe you'll live long enough to explain yourself to the council. I don't answer to the council. Or do you? I'm leaving this asteroid. If you try to stop me, I'll detonate these charges. And your helper and your friends are all going to die. <laughs> you don't get to leave, Valak. Not after what you've done. What I've done? This is nothing compared to what's been done to Batarians. We've been forced into exile, forced to survive on what we can scrounge up. It's been like that for decades. Why take it out on these people? They didn't do anything to you or the Batarians. Didn't do anything. Aside from colonizing a world that could have been ours, aside from using resources that should have been ours, we were left to defend ourselves. But the humans were stronger than us. Damn straight. You couldn't possibly understand. Actually, you just don't want to understand, and I'm done wasting my breath. Now, if you want your friends to live, I suggest you step aside. You can go, but this isn't over. Mm hmm. I mean, Tali, finally some action. What have we been doing this whole time? If not seeing action. Um, okay. That one's done. Oh my goodness, why does that keep happening? Stop. One's done. That one's done. There's one over here. Where is it? Is it up there? Oh. Where is it? OK. 
Okay. Did it. something I could have done to help. I thought I should be here. I know this asteroid better than anyone. Mm -hmm. did it. Another hour and our course would have been irreversible. I ran the numbers, Shepard. X-57 would have struck near the capital city, the most densely populated region. But that's not going to happen, thanks to you. Yep, thanks to us. Is she alright? Is her team? I think so. There are hostages in one of the offices nearby. Alex said he'd blow them up if I didn't let him leave. You let him go to save them? Is that... Will you get in trouble for that? I mean, he could do the same thing somewhere else, couldn't he? Yeah, he could. Balak seemed like a practical man. Practical, but callous. I'm sure if he'd been in my place, Miss Bowman would be dead now. Along with all the terrorists. But I'm not going to sacrifice people who happen to be between me and my target. So what happens now? Bad guys get away? If Balak gets away today, we'll still be after him tomorrow and the day after that. Me, my crew, and every other crew in the Alliance. He'll run and he'll hide, but eventually he'll slip up and we'll get him. Bad guys never get away, Simon. Not unless the good guys give up. Well, I wouldn't want you after me. Shepard, thank you for my grandchildren's lives. I don't think I'll stick around, though. Not with the team. What is going on with his hair? Before I go, I'd like to offer you something. Maybe you'll have more use for it than I will. Lead engineer, I get some quality items. Take your pick. Learn it. Um, so I know we can get his Omni tool, but we just got a good Omni tool, and I don't use it. So let's go for the light armor. Maybe it, hopefully it'll be better than ours. Yes. Yes, all of them. Their bodies. These are um, up to some updated textures. I guess it's better than not knowing. Take care of yourself. Be well, Shepard. All right. Yeah, this is one of those games where it more it more or less survives its age, but it really struggles um, like texture-wise, and so it really does a lot of lot to help it if you just improve the textures, you know. Tally. Roll up your decryption. Let me go to equipment. Let's take them. I will put the scimitar on. Where am I in Omni Gel? How am I doing there? I wish there was a faster way to do inventory management in this game because it's a real pain. And you just get so much stuff. Stuff. Oh, it's just, it's really painful.
Alright, let's go ahead and get this baby on. Let's see. the hardened weave on and we'll put on the armor plating 3 all right again I really wish there was a better way to do this <laughs> in this game Okay, and Tali could use a good shotgun. I don't know if she can use um, sniper rifles, but I'll give it to her. Why not? Alright. Looks good. I can't believe you let Valet go. Save us. I half expected you to just let us die. Sacrifice the few for the many. Then I'd be no better than the Batarians. Besides, Valak won't get away with this. I know who he is now. sound like my brother. He was always so stubborn, but always willing to do the right thing. I wish I could have saved him too. It's not your fault. I think, if I'm not mistaken, this is one of the DLC missions. He was the one who convinced me to join the team here. Said it would be an adventure. I, I don't mean to sound un. Get out of your way. Thank you. Uh, I don't even know your name. Shepard. Commander Shepard. Thank you, Commander Shepard. It's not exactly what I expected, but thank you. I'll get out of your way. So long, Kate. I appreciate that, Commander. Goodbye. All right. Let's just edit. I'm having a lot of trouble with the volume level of this game where it's either way too loud or way too quiet and like, at least for recording I can hear it fine in my headphones because that audio is separate but man it's just been kind of annoying <laughs> The game? What do you mean? Yeah, all oh, audio levels with the game. Um, because I even went in and fiddled with some stuff. I turned down the music, hoping to make it so the dialogue and stuff was louder. But. Yeah. But see, and if I'm talking, can you still hear me over talking? Cool. Well, then we will leave it at that. Perfect. How do I... Yeah, we're 
return to Normandy. All right, let's see. Where to next? See what's over here. Eden Prime, poor Eden Prime. And nothing here, so we can head to. Pinnacle Station or Pharaohs. Let's head to Novaria. another level I don't know I love the story of this game but there's a bunch of um missions that are really annoying Citadel business we got a council specter aboard Get out of here. This is my favorite squad to use. I know it's not the most well balanced, but it's my favorite. My favorite squad. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. It is this way. Here to cause problems. This is an unscheduled arrival. I need your credentials. I'm a specter. My name is Shepard. Load of horse crap, Reader. We will need to confirm that. Also, I must advise you that firearms are not permitted on Novaria. Mm. Sergeant Sterling, secure their weapons. It would not be wise to search for the Geth unarmed. Nobody takes my weapon. Charge and lock! We are authorized to use lethal force. You have to the count of three to surrender your weapons. One, two, three. Captain Matsuo, stand down! We confirmed their identity. Spectres are authorized to carry weapons here, Captain. You may proceed, Spectre. I hope the rest of your visit will be less confrontational. Parasini san will meet you upstairs. Behave yourself. All right. That was easy. I 
name Gianna Parasini, assistant to Administrator Analeas. We apologize for the incident in the docking bay. I appreciate your help. You're welcome. You understand our security chief was only doing her job. One of my duties is orientation of new arrivals. Do you have any questions? Pretty heavy security for such a small port. The executive board does everything in its power to protect the privacy of our client corporations. I can't have my investigation hampered. Tread lightly. The board can bury you in litigation. You'd need an Asari lawyer to see the case through. Has anyone unusual passed through here recently? Unusual? An Asari matriarch passed through a few mm. years ago. Lady Benezia. I forgot Benezia, Benezia was here. She is here? Can I speak with her? Benezia left for the Peak 15 research complex days ago. To the best of my knowledge, she's still there. Could you tell me how to get there? You'll need to ask Administrator Analeas for clearance to leave this port. Where can I find the Administrator? His office is on the main level, left at the top of the elevator. Understood. Can we go in now? Of course. If you need any help, you can ask me at the Administrator's office. She is here. I can't believe it. I imagine you want to talk to me, Shepard. About my mother. No, we don't. I trust you, Liara. You may not be military, but you're a part of my crew. Thank Liara. You, best, uh, best girl. Right me. there. Probably one of my favorite characters in, like, video games. I don't know what it is about her, but I'm just a real big fan. Ordering dinner. Gonna have me some Chipotle. I'm excited for that. Be here in about an hour. So we'll play for another hour. I'll take a break for dinner. And then I'll we will come back afterwards and play some more. You know, I just like it. I like they have really good corn salsa. I like the corn, the roasted corn salsa that they have. But the big benefit is that you see, that's I love where I live. Love it. I love the state of Maryland. I love. I love it. Love it. Love it. Um, but it is not a big foodie state. Um, now, don't get me wrong. If you like, if you like seafood, man, there are a few places as good to come as Maryland. I mean, blue crab is right here in our bay. Crab cakes, scallops, all this stuff, delicious here in Maryland. Um, but if it's not seafood, you're gonna, you, you might find the occasional foodie restaurant. Like, there's a really good Hawaiian place here in Maryland. Um... But and he uh, near me actually. But otherwise, you're kind of stuck. Uh, you know, I like it. And, and sushi's good too. I love sushi. But I love Tex-Mex food. Is some of my favorite food in the world. And there just is not a lot of good options near me, especially. Um, and Chipotle delivers uh, through Postmates. So you know. This one offers I'm not going to complain. It's it's convenient. That is on the list of places I want to go. Um, we are tentatively, my wife and I, tentatively planning to take our um, our son there when he's around 10. So that'll be 10 years from now. So we're, I mean, obviously, it's very tentative. It's a distance away. Uh, he's not even born yet, but. Um, that is our kind of plan because I really want to go, and she has interest, and so we're kind of excited. News travels fast here. Oh yes, I do. <laughs> I I haven't been. Yeah, we found out on Sunday. 
Um, we're having a boy. Uh, his name is going to be Phoenix. Uh, we're really, we're really excited. It would compensate you. This one has procured a special item for a customer. The item is not permitted within the station, but you could bring it through customs. Thanks. I appreciate it. I am very, I am very excited. We kind of wanted a girl, but honestly, I wasn't even disappointed when we cut into the cake and found out. Like, I was still just as excited. You want me to use my status to smuggle for you? That is not inaccurate. Probably not. And Callista's a great name. I mean, not only are we on different coasts, but, you know, different countries. I can't remember what the reward for this is. And, I, you know, I'm going to not do it because my shepherd won't smuggle. Nope, I'm sounds shady. The law, not break it. This one understands. The offer shall remain open. But I actually chose, we chose the name Phoenix. Okay. Well, if you're on the east coast of the states, you're welcome to, my wife and I will happily take you out for uh, dinner or something, if you're interested. Uh, yeah, no. We're going to go. I found that shopping in this first game especially, too, is just not worth it. You pick up a lot of stuff. I'm on duty, Spectre. I shouldn't be talking. And, you know, that's kind of why my wife and I are leaning on only having one kid. Everyone we've talked to says that we'll break down and have a second. But, you know, with one kid... Yeah. But with one kid, you can just travel easier, um, you know. And we want to, we want our our son to be. I mean, cultured is such a snobby word, um, but that's the best thing I can think of to say. Um, we just want them to feel like they're part of the world instead of just part of you know, you know, the local area. I don't know. It's kind of corny, but that's our plan. I, I agree. Yeah, and like the states are huge. <laughs> okay, yeah. You, you you're correct. I need a moment of your time. The male human at the hotel bar. He's a sales rep. I don't know. Like like we haven't nothing is specific and locked in obviously. Do you know who I am? Everyone And the Canada's big too. That makes you ideal for my job. Just I know plenty of people that would ravel, rather travel, and I know it's bigger, but I know plenty of people that growing up that don't even think about going to another country when they talk about vacation. They just say, oh, we're going to go to Florida. Oh, we're going to go to Maine. Oh, we're going to go to California. Oh, we're going to go to Seattle. But they don't ever think about leaving and going to another country. Whereas you look at Europe, people like, go all over the place. I mean, I'm from a tiny town here in Maryland. Uh, I live in a bigger area now, but growing up, it was a very rural town, and I knew plenty of people that had no, like, I had no, like, inkling about ever leaving, ever leaving the, the small town. I don't know anything about Binary Helix. What would I talk to Vargas about? I represent the Aramali City Council on Thessia. Our town is known for its biotic amp crafters. What is your city's interest in binary helix? They do not manufacture amps. Much of BH's work relates to biotics. 
there are rumors that the Novaria branch has flown in Asari biotics. So those two timers that just came up, um, I've been trying to get work for probably weeks, and I haven't been able to get them to work, and now all of a sudden they're working, and I'm not sure why. Can't tell you. I have no idea why they're working. I will give you a device that will crack into his that's the, I think that's the second time I've ever seen them post in my chat. They will infiltrate binary helix. I'm using the cloud bot from Streamlabs. But I'm thinking about con uh, switching over to a more customizable chat bot because I've been having difficulty with it with this cloud bot. You think this uniform's just for show? My job is to enforce the law, not break it. Okay. Do you think that Binary Helix obeys all the laws? That they do not spy on other companies? What they might be doing somewhere else doesn't justify my acting against them here. Very well, Spectre. I will be on my way. Huh, that, that is strange. So, I can't... What am I supposed to be doing here? Go speak to Administrator Annalise to leave Port Hanshaw. His office is upstairs. Okay. Is it up here upstairs? I haven't played this part of this game in forever. No, he's not up here. I didn't think he was. Where's the stairs? Yes! And we're super excited. Uh, we're having a boy. I'm very... We're very excited. I love how it says that his office is upstairs, but I'm pretty sure it's over here in the corner, which is definitely not upstairs. Unless I guess it maybe was referring to upstairs when I was downstairs at the port. I'd no. like to speak to Analeas. One moment, please. Mr. Analeas. It does yes, for sure one. make it more real. Commander Shepard I agree. Is asking to see you, sir. Right, fine. Come in. All right, let me see. He's in here. You will excuse me if I don't stand up. I have no time to entertain colonial rubes. I'm here as a specter, not a human. Keep that in mind. Believe me, that is foremost in my mind. This greeting is a courtesy. I will only cooperate as required by the executive board. Businesses come here to avoid the second guessing of galactic law. I'm conducting an investigation. It's a matter of galactic security. Yes, isn't everything. I will not allow you to harass our clients. This world is private property. 
Opold wants me to smuggle a package through security. I need more than your word to act on that. Bring me whatever he's smuggling, and I'll act accordingly. So you'll arrest him? No one here is fond of trials. They make shareholders nervous. More likely, we would simply let him go. Of course, he would be blacklisted by the companies here. I'll look into it and get back to you. I appreciate your report. I've heard an Asari matriarch is here. Hi, honey. Venezia? She arrived a few days ago. I'm sorry that I couldn't pick up your phone call. She's up at peak 15. I'd like to see her immediately. I'm afraid that you cannot. Peak 15 is a private facility in the Scotty Mountains. Regardless, there is a blizzard in the area. Shuttles are grounded and surface access has been cut off. Surface access, you say? Cut off, I said. The roads are not suitable for travel. Don't make an issue of this, Shepard. Let him be stubborn, Shepard. I'm sure someone else here is willing to help us. I have no more questions at this time. Good. I received a dozen urgent messages while you dithered about. Hmm. Gosh, I hate people like that. Mr. Analeus isn't the only one with a path to reopen the channel. Ooh, okay. You've never worked in the corporate world, have you, Commander? You can't bludgeon through bureaucracy. So it would seem. I need an alternative. Talk to Lorik Keen. You should be able to find him at the hotel bar. Can't say more. Not with an earshot of Mr. Analeus. All right. All right. Very well. well, let's go get that stuff that what's his face is trying to smuggle. That's illegal. And Shepard is an upholding member of the upstanding member of the law enforcement community. And he will not put up with such illegal uh, with such illegal activity. Has the other reconsidered this one's plea for aid? All right, I'll help. This one humbly thanks the specter. The package will be delivered to your vessel. All you need do is bring it to this one. Please do not mention this to Administrator Analeas. That one would levy fees. Mm -hmm. Is there anything else this one might help you with? No. I'm just browsing right now. This one awaits your return. Let's head back up to that bar. Then we can talk to that lady and see what she wants because I think we can turn her into. Generally, I help these people because I hate Hinalaeus, but I'm I'm role playing a good shepherd. Shepherd doesn't put up with nonsense, and he especially doesn't do anything illegal. There's Lorik. Where'd she go? Oh, she's already gone. All right. Well, cool. Afternoon. Sit down. Have a drink. What can I do for you? Are you Lorik Keen? I heard you might be able to help me. You are the Spectre that just arrived, are you not? Mm-hmm. What can an old Turian like me possibly help you with? I'm trying to find a way into the garage. I have places to go. You need a pass. How fortuitous. I'm the manager of the local Synthetic Insights office. For the moment, at least. Mr. Analeas closed my office. He claims to be investigating reports of my corruption. The administrator is an interesting man. He's become quite wealthy since he took direct control of Red. What a scumbag. I sense a connection there. Indeed. I acquired evidence of Analeas's actions. His hired goons are ransacking my office to find it. I suspect your goal lies outside this port. Mr. Analeas would be disinclined to let you wander. If you recover the evidence from my office, I will give you my garage pass, as well as a sum of credits. Okay, cool. Do you have a plan? I do. 
However, there is one other. What is that charming human expression? Fly in the lotion? And mm -hmm. is that a Violence saying? Against Mr. Analeas's thugs may be necessary. He I don't know if I've ever heard that as a saying before. He's Fly in the lotion? Miss Matsuo is unaware of their outside employment. If I have to kill the guards, I'm afraid I can't help you. There's still the law around here. True enough. Though I hasten to point out that Ms. Matsuo disapproves of outside contracting. If you change your mind, I will remain here. I see no other options. Uh, let's see. So that's not gonna work. Shepard's gonna try to obey the law. He's a good boy. So let's go out and get that smuggled goods and so we can turn them into Analeas. See how fast that elevator moved when it was getting called up to where I was and how slow it's moving now? What's going on with that? Warship was unexpected. No harm was done. That is a generous attitude. My thanks. Try and let is her there know. I can do for you today, Commander. There are guards everywhere. Are there that many problems here? I am sure Parasini san gave you the ultra special blah blah about business here. Everyone wants to be protected from everyone else, but everyone also thinks they have a special right to kick over everyone else. So you have to keep them from getting too eager. Most of my job is diplomacy. Two corps start yelling at each other, my people walk in, flash some ceramic, and they start talking civilly. If there is anything this job has taught me, it's how to be impartial. Okay. Don't they have their own security forces? Everything from hackers to mercenaries. They have investments to protect, after all. But, which is why the companies constantly try to bribe my people. I have a clear policy against freelancing. Anyone who works on the side is fired. Okay, but how do I tell her about those people that are working on I'll the side? On. Very good, Commander. Please stay out of trouble. I guess I can't. Get out of here. Let's go turn that stuff into uh, Analyze. need to up now sensitivity
Mm, maybe not. We'll see. Thank you. All right. Well. I presume you are here to present me with Opold's package. Yes, I have it with me. I am no weapons expert, but it seems to me that this is a rather advanced device. Certainly contraband. It would have been unfortunate if this had reached its buyer. thankful are you? I am willing to give you 200 credits and a pass to leave Hanshan. Not without an understanding between us, of course. You can only go to Peak 15 to speak to Lady Benezia. If you cause trouble or if the staff asks you to leave, you will be thrown off world. You know, that's a dangerous weapon. It shouldn't be left unsecured. I should impound it. Of course. That makes perfect sense. Ooh, but what is it? What, what is it? Way. It would be best if you kept it. If there is nothing else, I would like to go back to work. I'm leaving. Good. Thanks. That chemical. Yay. Seriously? Or was it the assault rifle? I mean, I don't use it. I can't really use it. Right? Because what do they have? Nothing helpful. Yeah, Tally's all shotguns and pistols. Alright, let's head over to the garage. Access to the garage is restricted. I have a pass. I have authorization. Excuse me. <laughs> yes, that's genuine. Drive safely. The weather's supposed to be pretty bad out in the Lucas Valley. All right. Got there was some geth in here. I didn't realize you could do this. This makes this fight so much easier. Man, that fight, I had used to struggle so much with that fight. I had no idea you could get in that turret. Ugh, so much easier.
All right. Let's go find Matriarch Benezia. Never say no to some stuff. Oh, it is so satisfying to shoot these 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 like infantry guys with the um with like that big with the big gun on the Mako. This is really satisfying. fought these before. Why are we watching this? Handled. Got it. All right. Just obliterated. Handled. Was that worth it? I thought for sure that was more than just a med kit.
All right. Got it. Oh, I thought I fixed this. Uh This is a weird glitch in the game. Uh So I will um we'll play through a little bit of this and but I will when I when we when I break for dinner I will see what I can do to f oh gosh this is awful I'm assuming that's a Krogan This is real bad. Oh my goodness, this is really distracting. I'm, I'm gonna have to fix this before I keep playing. Because this is gonna drive me insane. Facilities have suffered a great deal of damage. Yikes. Oh no, pretty close. I think this is because I'm running a Ryzen processor. From my understanding, I knew this glitch was a thing in Mass Effect 1, but I thought I had fixed it. So I, I guess not. So we will finish clearing out this room and then I will save and then we'll stall. I'll take the break for dinner and then we'll be back. I'll be back later tonight to, after I hopefully I've fixed it to keep playing. So actually we will take the break there. Here's the quick save. I will be back um, probably around uh, 9 p.m. Eastern Time. Um, if something comes up and I'm not going to be back, I'll let you know. Um, I'll update um, the title of the Twitch page. Uh, and I'll also tweet that I'm not coming back. Um, so anyway, I will see you all soon. Have a, I will be back shortly. Uh, at least after I eat dinner. In about three hours or so. Bye.